let us discuss what is online learning what is learning management system and what are functions of learning management system let us see how online learning is defined through this module learners will be able to define online learning discuss features of learning management system let us see how online learning is defined Michigan Department of Education has defined online learning a structured learning activity that utilizes technology with internet intranet based tools and resources as the delivery method for instruction research assessment and communication so online learning is a structured activity we use internet or intranet for performing this structured activity what happens in this activity in online learning learners interact communicate via technology based material via technology mode it may involve teaching research assessment so there are three aspects of online learning internet learning process and learning environment as we said in online learning web based communication is essential that's why internet is an essential part we can also create online learning environment through intranet learning process is a very essential component because it's online learning and because online learning needs to be enabled some environment is essential so in any online learning one learning environment is planned and created connectivity flexibility and interactivity are three aspects of any online learning we need to be connected we need to be flexible and we require interactivity learners access material any time any how and through any mode that's why flexibility and connectivity is required there is interaction between learners and material learners and learners learners and teachers i mentioned that online learning requires learning environment now this learning environment is generally known as virtual learning environment the system which enables virtual learning is known as learning management system what is a learning management system basically learning management system is a platform a platform which is online a platform on which material is developed uploaded teachers log in students log in in one environment on that virtual platform learners access material so teachers upload material let us see what all happens in our face to face classroom instructors teach deliver information or show some media may uh, be a teacher is playing a video or an audio file then there is discussion in the classroom where students also talk teachers ask or teachers talk maybe students ask some questions which teachers answer teachers give some assignments some group work some individual projects there are discussions going on there may be some projects going on there are project presentations there is homework which is done there are assessments can all these activities be possible virtually if we want all these activities to be done we require a system we require a platform and that's why such a platform which enables all these activities is known as learning management system this system manages the entire learning all activities whichever are components of learning are managed by this system we have seen what is virtual learning what is virtual learning environment and what is system which manages learning sometimes virtual learning environment and learning management systems are considered synonymous terms let us see how mark styles has defined is 
totems. A virtual learning environment or learning management system is designed to act as a focus for students learning activities and their management and facilitation along with the provision of content and resources required to help make the activities successful. Let us again summarize some functions of learning management system. We have seen that instructors can deliver material via learning management systems. We can upload any material, links, files on this platform. We can embed many online tools also, some synchronous or asynchronous communication tools. We have a separate module to understand what we mean by synchronous and asynchronous communication. But this synchronous and asynchronous communication is possible through various tools which can be embedded inbuilt into any learning management system. We can link blogs, we can create chat rooms, we can create discussion forums in such learning management systems. For example, Moodle. Moodle is one learning management system. There are many other learning management systems like Blackboard. We can see all such tools, online tools embedded in these systems. Flexibility is possible because of such systems. Because material is already uploaded on LMS, there is flexibility of time. This LMS can be accessed through various devices, so flexibility of place can be achieved. Students can come together in this learning management systems, as I mentioned, maybe through discussion forums, maybe on chat rooms. So participation of students is another function of learning management system. Because students can participate, they can upload their assignments also. So assessment is possible on such systems.